president's remarks rippled across the country. Here in Hawaii, those on either side of the issue weighed in on what this could mean. KITV4's Catherine Cruz has the story. Braden Morgan and Dalen Wells both work at Kaneohe Marine Base. Morgan is a Marine sergeant and Wells is a civilian staffer. They were surprised but pleased with the news that the president made clear his position on gay marriage. And I was like, finally, yes. The couple made national headlines recently after posting this homecoming picture on the Internet. They said they can thank Obama for dropping the military's don't ask, don't tell policy and allowing them the freedom to express themselves like anyone else. Being a Marine, I will, you know, I will abide by the orders and the regulations of any commander in chief, whether it be President Barack Obama or um, Mitt Romney if he becomes president. However, I will say personally, my own personal opinion, this gives me a lot more hope for the next four years. His coming out in support of marriage equality now surprised me a little bit. I thought it would have been put off till after the election. So it was nice to see it happen now, whether it was because of what Joe Biden said or not. Hawaii Family Forum, which has long advocated for marriage as between one man and one woman, said today, It's up to the people of Hawaii and the people of our nation. It's up to the people to decide whether they want him as a president or not. So again, with a government of the people, for the people, and we'll find out uh, during the elections in November. As for Morgan and Wells, they say since their homecoming kiss went viral, work is still work, and Morgan still puts on his uniform every morning. The one difference will come this month when they move to New Orleans, Morgan's new duty station. Just say one last thing. Um, thank you. Catherine Cruz, KITV 4 News. Hawaii Senators Daniel Akaka and Daniel Inouye have both issued statements in support of Obama's stance on marriage equality. Senator Akaka said, quote, I am proud of President Obama for taking this courageous stand, and I know his upbringing in diverse Hawaii helped to shape his understanding that everyone should be treated with equality. Senator Inouye wrote, how can we call ourselves the land of the free if we do not permit people who love one another to get married? I look forward to working with the president to ensure his position on marriage equality becomes law in this country.